Okay, so here's my mini portable washer. Inside, this is the wash, this is the ring side. And if you close it. These two holes right here are for your water hoses. And then this right here is your wash timer for obviously washing your clothes. And then this is for gentle normal drain, the type of wash. And this is your spin timer and it goes up to about five minutes, which is literally all it needs. Okay, so <laughs> I said, okay, weird. Instead of using my hose, cause I like it where it is, I got two little buckets from the Dollar Tree and I've just been using those and it works just the same. So I'll just go ahead and show you how to use it. Obviously it's empty inside. I'm gonna get some, have some clothes. Okay, so there I just did a sweater, a shirt, yoga pants, another shirt, pajama pants. And that's about how full I'll ever let mine get. And then, so make sure before you start filling it up with water, do not make the mistake that I have made before. Make sure you switch it to normal and that it's not on drain. Mine says rain because you know, it got a little, anyways, make sure it's on normal before you start filling it up with water. And then I'll go ahead and take the bucket of water. I always use this one for like the fresh water. I always use that one for the drainage water. So fill it up. And so I just go ahead and pour in my water. And on the side of the washer, there is a small, medium, and high. Yeah. <laughs> Load. So I'll fill my water up to the high since I had it pretty high. Okay, so now I filled it to the H line and then I already put my soap and detergent. I'm gonna go ahead and close the lid and then I'm gonna switch it all the way to 15 and let it run. And then I can actually show you what it looks like when it starts spinning. And then I'll wait to drain it and then I can show you the dryer side or ringing okay, side. Okay, so it's done spinning, completely done with its cycle. And then now I have my empty bucket of water and I'm gonna go ahead and switch it to drain. And then I'll watch it. Yep, <laughs> it just got some on my floor. But I'll watch it and for it to fill up and then I put it back to normal when it does fill up so I can switch out the bucket and refill again. Okay, so it's finishing up draining a little bit and while that's going, I'm going to go ahead and put some of the clothes into the spinner. So I'll go ahead and do this pair of pants and then maybe this shirt and we can fit one more thing and another shirt. And then do make sure you kind of tuck in on the sides or just make sure it's in there because if a flap comes out like this, it literally makes the worst freaking noise ever. It's so loud and no. And then, okay, so the trick to this, oh wait, I almost forgot. You gotta pour your water on it. So I'll take a clean bucket again, Let's which I already have. Water, and I'll just pour my water over the clothes until I feel like it's kind of drained enough. And you can do this once or twice. I usually kind of just do it once. It doesn't really need it twice for my clothes. So I close it, close the lid. And then this is another trick. Turn it slowly so that it starts up and then goes into a smooth process. Because if you start it way too fast, it's like, like it just sounds stupid, it's so loud, but it's supposed to sound this smooth. Not rocking at all, not like, cause I saw some other girls videos and I was like, ma'am, no. It is supposed to sound smooth. It is not supposed to be loud like that at all. I don't know what she was doing or thinking, but you do you girl, but this is how it's supposed to sound, just saying. And then another thing about this, so you know how you can open up the spin side or the washer side when it's running? This one automatically stops so that you don't hurt yourself. <laughs> but anyways, and then it'll start right back up on its own again smoothly, thankfully. And then yeah, it's just gonna keep draining into the water because I keep it on drainage while it spins. Okay, so it's completely done spinning out and literally like they're dry almost. Like it rings out all the water. 
It's not soaked at all. It's pretty dry. It's only a little damp. And then I just go and hang them up. <laughs> I just go and hang them up. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And then I'll go and rinse that one out, which this, Jesus. <laughs> this can probably fit together. So yeah, and then I just repeat the process and that's pretty much it. And this again is that portable washer or mini portable washer, cup it washer. <laughs> but yeah, hope you enjoyed.